Hey everybody, it's Jordan with PDQ.com, and we're back with another Zero Day, which is usually when I'm here talking to you, because got to come mention stuff's broken. Uh, so this one involves Google Chrome. It's CVE 2022-4135, and what it, it will allow a remote attacker, and I'm just going to read this because I don't fully understand it, if that makes you feel any safer or not. A remote attacker has compromised the renderer process to potentially perform a sandbox escape via a crafted HTML page. Uh, in layman term, I'd say if you hit a bad site, they have the ability to uh, escape and do things to your computer. That's not great, especially with it being Cyber Monday. People are, instead of doing their work right now, they're shopping. But we don't want them to go to a bad link, so we're going to go ahead and update Chrome, make sure everyone is safe. Uh, so Chrome does have its built-in update where you can just hit the three dots and go to the latest version. But since we are assuming this is more of a corporate environment, we're going to go over how you can keep that up-to-date and safe with PDQ Deploy. We open up deploy here. Uh, if you go to the package library and just type in Chrome, you can see that we have the pre-built package. This one on our part is already updated to fix that zero day that's out there. So if you double click on that, it will download. As you can see here, I have already done that one. So from this, you can just go ahead and hit deploy once and you can just add your entire environment or it's just computers you want to hit, but you can just push that out to everyone and it will update for them. If you've already been using our products to do the update, you probably have in this package library here, the auto download approvals. If you have that set to like seven days, just because a new release comes out, you don't want to update right away. You want to make sure you're safe and secure. It's going to be caught up in here for up to seven days where on this case, you might be best to push that along. So you could just highlight Chrome there and hit approve now. That'll push it through and it'll kick off your schedules and you don't have to worry about it from that point. That's pretty much everything uh, we need to, need to know on that one. Chrome's an easy update uh, where something like this sooner is better than later. And luckily, this is the kind of thing where it won't impact your users uh, on their workspace. But remember, if they are using it when it updates, it's not going to fully update until they close down Chrome. So you may want to look at to an avenue of uh, alerting the users to say, hey, please, please restart your Chrome so you're safe. That's pretty much everything for this one. Uh, for PDQ.com, I'm Jordan.